G'day, my name is Chris Mufflard, I'm a project engineer at Vico Software. Welcome to the Schedule Planner video training series level 3. In this vignette we're going to show you how to define the location order and how we can set that within a custom view. In this vignette we're going to show you that the left hand hierarchical column in the flow line schedule is a representation of the LBS as well as you'll learn how to manually adjust the LBS in Schedule Planner to resequence crew flow. It is assumed that you've watched the previous vignette and that you have already defined your tasks with productivity rates. Basically, the project precision level or hierarchy is the schedule's representation of the LBS we just created in the LBS Manager. It is important to note that the LBS Manager is where we create the physical 3D representations of the zones. Schedule Planner, we are sequencing them in an order which would benefit the project. Basically, this won't damage the physical location in the 3D LBS Manager. However, it will only change the order that they are in. Let's look to the current location system to see if there's any way that we can optimize it. As you can see, Level 2, Zone 3, is causing a gap with what could be continuous work between Level 1, Zone 1, and Level 2, Zone 2. We can simply modify this by first right-clicking at the project hierarchy level, selecting the change display order, and manipulating the hierarchy or location display order to move level 2, zone 3 to the end of the project. Let's click OK. As you can see, now that we have moved level 2, zone 3, we have created continuous task lines through our schedule. This will improve not only the sequencing, but the location order in which we plan to complete this project. In this vignette, you have been shown how to manually adjust the location hierarchy to create a new sequence. 